she's not that type of girl. <laughs> Dinner with me first, jeez. But anyway. Don't keep me So I'm here at my hair appointment. I am about to get my hair braided. Um, nothing fancy dancy or anything like that. So yeah, see you guys in a minute. Woo All right guys, it is now, what time is it? I've gotten my hair done, it's 2.17. Um, I gotta run and get uh, pick up babe from the house because we're gonna ride together and go and get some balloons for fatty Go pick her up get the boys and then we're going to the junk place um, After that so Finna head over because it's already after almost 2 30 and fatty gets out at 2 55 Darling, I love my braider. She's super dope love her she did an amazing job so yes i'm definitely enjoying that sorry about the lighting guys but um yeah so shall see you in a moment i'll pick back up the camera when it is time darling okay see you when i see ya mm. oh, fuck these niggas so i'm outside on the block what you trying to do mm. Good morning. <sighs> anyway, excuse the bed. It is morning. Um, got some plans today. I'm actually about to shower. And let me set you guys up here. But I am about to shower and get dressed. Got a nail appointment at 10 o'clock. It's already going on nine, and I literally just found out. I don't know why. I may, I was up late, but I was doing other things. Um, didn't get the message from a nail tech that the location changed. Um, transparency, right? So her AC went out at the shop, and she's gonna keep, still do my appointment, but she's gonna move it to her house, and I'm perfectly fine with that, um, especially being that. The appointment was already set, but that means that now the new location is 24, 25 minutes away. So, yeah. And I couldn't get these ones off, um, so I'm going to have to do a soak. How lovely is that, right? Um, anyway. So, yeah. I'm going to get dressed. And, um, I don't even know what I'm wearing. That's the funny thing is, I don't even know what I'm wearing. But, I'm going to get dressed and I'll see you guys probably when I get in the car. I'm recording a video with your nasty ass. You rolled on me and then you mounted me to play sleep. You know what I'm saying? For a quick second. It's alright, boo. It's alright. You're fucking trashy. You nasty. And you can't help it. You can't help it. Now you want something, daddy. You know what I'm saying? Get out. <laughs> Don't mind him. Because if we think he's blowing up on my shit, okay? Sorry, y'all. I'm being a fat ass. <laughs> I don't care. Gotta gain this weight for this surgery. Anyway. Mm. The outfit of the day or whatever. She killed with her little two-piece outfit from Fashion Nova. <coughs> Alright, I'm going now. I didn't name a damn bread so fast. I think I'm gonna take a boost. So when I come back, I shall clean. I gotta do my room. I really wanna change my living room around. But anywho, and headed to the nail shop. I ain't got no ear bobs on. All right, y'all, I'll be back. Okay. 
Don't do nothing I wouldn't do. Oh my God, earlier. Oh, look at what the day brings us. Is she bright or whatever in party? Earlier when I woke up, it was super bright and sunny or whatever. And I thought it was gonna be like 86 degrees again. But we're starting this time because yesterday and the day before, it rained. But whatevs, right? Excuse me. Ooh, so trashy. Anyway, I should have took Babe's car while he always up in my shit. Anyway, so I'm headed out because I'm actually moving a little late. <laughs> You know, this late thing for me has become a little <laughs> abundant, okay? Nevertheless, I got my little, um, we should have make it do what it do, okay? So, I'm finna hit the road. Oh my God, is that what time it is? I gotta go. All right, bye. <laughs> all right uh oh i don't think y'all gonna stay up there anyway all right i am leaving my nail appointment sorry for the lighting or whatever they are cute i don't even know if y'all could see that because of the light but anyway got my nails done um i actually finished a little early or whatever Babe says my fur thing is a little big, and I won't admit this to him, but I will admit it to you guys. I think it is. Look at it. <laughs> Fuck y'all. Don't care. Anyway, um, <laughs> he would love to hear me admit to him that maybe this is a bit much, but I don't care. Um, about to head back. Uh, it is a little early, so... Um, I was thinking, oh wait, my groceries are should be there. So I'm actually going to go home because I have groceries being delivered. And I wanted to get out and possibly, I've been looking for wall art. So since I have a little bit of time, let's see what time is it. It's only 12.30. So I'm thinking I might head over to TJ Maxx. Oh, I'm going to go to Burlington instead. I'm going to go to Burlington because, yeah, why not? So, let's see. Where is there a Burlington close to me before I get home? And, uh, yeah. So, I'm going to go see if I can find anything at Burlington really fast. Probably grab something to eat and head home. Um... Not that the groceries can't be put up or anything like that while I'm not there because Babe and them are at the house. So, nevertheless, let's head on over to, um, what you mean call it? So, that's what we're going to do. Going to head on over to Burlington and call it a day. Hey girl. Anyway, whew, she's back. You probably hear my fan, don't you? Let's work on that. How about we do that? How about we take care of that girl? Anyway, let's take care of that. <sighs> my day was fairly well. That it was. Okay, I set off just for a minute. Okay. So my day went fairly well, nevertheless, right? Sorry for the lighting. It's not daylight. It's actually about 8.37 p.m. on this good old, good old, uh, what today is? Saturday. Anyway. 
So, I took that back. Today is Friday. <laughs> Y'all tried to play me. You tried to play me. I caught that. I caught that. Anyway, you like my little get up? You like my little number or whatever? You like this little number? Look at that. She's cute. She's cute. <laughs> yes, that's my little Shein number. Or whatever. But anyways, um, I did go get my nails done today. Uh, should be on a clip from earlier. Um, but got that taken care of today, which was super cool. Got out, got some woman time or whatever um groceries were delivered of course while i was getting my nails done so babe took the liberty of putting up my groceries so well our groceries whatever anyway so he did do that for me oh my goodness looking at that hmm just sorry i'm a drifter Get to know me, okay, cousin? Don't do that. Don't do that, sis. Don't judge me. Judge your mother. Anywho, um, as I was saying, he put the groceries up for me, and that was super sweet. He had already cleaned up some of the things that I had on my list to do. He took those things off my list today, um, and that was really, really awesome and sweet of him, so... Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, so I did. Get, I enjoyed my nail tech today. Let's see if it'll um focus in. I don't know. She did an awesome job. Loved it. Um, let's see. I'll show you guys the other hand too. She really did good. I loved it. But she's gonna be leaving. I did all of this to move here, find a new nail tech. And now, and shortly, she'll be leaving. Um, nevertheless, I think I hear the kids and babe in there wrestling. I do. Anyway, so she's going to be leaving. <clears throat> that really, you know, kind of sad me a little bit. But I'll still enjoy her while she's here. Um, she's going to be doing some traveling back and forth here over the next couple months, which is okay. Um, because surgery is going to be in July. So, July 4th, I fly out. Well, actually, I fly from here from home to Texas, um, to meet with my sister. So, we're meeting in Texas. She's already there. Um, and gonna spend the night. So, I'll fly here from the 3rd. Fly home, well, it's not home anymore. I used to live in Texas as well. But um, get there on the 3rd. We already have a room booked and taken care of and everything like that. And we fly out the next morning at about 4 a.m. So we'll be leaving from there, heading to Florida where we'll have a layover. And, uh, yeah, so, and then we'll go ahead and fly on out, honey. <laughs> Can't wait for that. And I did get some more, or like every day, not every day, but I don't know, for the last few months or so, I've just been like collecting what I need for surgery, right? Um, like I said, I am going to make a video here sooner than later about details on that, you know, or whatnot. But um, I did, let me see, I believe that I can show you, let's see. Look at there. You see that um, right over there? Don't judge. So yeah. Let's just, you know, the, right? 
anyways um that's just some things that I have been collecting over time. I really, I have been digging my little jammy sets. Look at that. That I've been getting or whatever from Shein. Super cute, affordable. I am going to go ahead and put some info out about that. So, I'll, that's another video, right? Anywho, so I got out. Got my nails done, and since I was a little ways away from home, um, I decided to check out the area that I was in and just see, you know, what kind of goodies was in the area. And they definitely had a Burlington, and I actually stumbled across a City Trends. I, look, I know. I know. City Trends can be... A hit or a miss, okay? I get it. But you can definitely find some gems in City Trends um, for home decor or, you know, just home essential items and things like that. And you can always find a few clothing pieces. And I mean, I don't know what you're looking for and I don't know your life, but you can find some cute items in there. Don't sleep on it, boo. Do not. Anywho, I never even made it into the City Trends anyway. I went into the Burlington because it was there and I was looking for particular items, okay? I was looking for <clears throat> some items for the house. So, I definitely want to change the curtains in here. Um, although, I love the contrast of the two blues with the white being there. Eh, it's cute or whatever. It's side. Right. It was just something quick and easy just to throw up. And it was cheapy cheapy or whatever. You know. Um, and I think the curtains are super super cute. Regardless. I'm just going to probably put them up for save them for another time. Right. However, I wanted to take away the blue from the window. Um, now that is... I wanted to take away the blue because um, it just, that's a lot of blue going on in here, right? I still got a few things. Don't judge my room. You know, I got some things going on in here. I'm still getting some decorative uh, things going on and organizing and what have you. I mean, I've been here a few months. I've done some changes and whatnot, but geez, I am just ready you know, I love decorating. I really do. But when you're um, basically changing over a color scheme or changing over a theme or anything like that, it becomes a little chaotic. Like, ugh. Anywho, it becomes a little chaotic or whatever because your house be in shambles and you be changing stuff over and adding stuff in. This didn't fit. I need to go get a drill. I need this. The drywall won't take. That drill don't go through that beam. That's a low bearing wall. I'm starting to feel like I'm building a house. Like, ugh, that is not <laughs> what I was going for. I'm not the DIY type of chick. Okay? I... So, I want to change these curtains out. Take the blue out. It's a little harsh up against um, my beautiful. I love my bed, y'all. I love this. I pray to pill it, print the print the print the print it. Anyway, that's my baby. She's my baby. <laughs> you know, you got to fall in love with pieces when you buy them for your house, right? And she's my baby. She'll forever be in my home. Even when I get a home home, um, a forever home or whatever, if I decide to change up my bedding or anything, I believe that this piece of furniture would probably be in a guest room somewhere or something like that. So, <laughs> she's a staple. Anyway, so we're going to take the blue out and I did find some other curtains. I'm actually going to take the white down as well. The two blue ones came together and the two white ones came together. 
So, two different packaging or whatever. But I did, in Burlington, find... Ooh, look what I found in Burlington, right? So, she was looking... I mean, don't sleep on Burlington, Ross, Dee Dee's, City Trends, all those cute little places, honey. Please, don't sleep on them, okay? I'll tell you why. There's a few reasons why. I mean, like, you can find your whole life in those stores. I mean, maybe you're just not addicted like I am. Anyway. I digress, right? Okay, so I found, I think I wanted to go with the silver look in here so that it can go with my mirrored furniture. That's my mirrored end tables on the sides there. And I am still looking for a mirrored dresser for both babe and I. Um, for both of our dressers, because right now our dressers are black. So definitely want to change that, right? Um, they're in very, very good standing. There's nothing wrong with our dressers. It's just, I want a different aesthetic. So either we're going to sell this one. I'm like offer up or something or the marketplace. I don't know. Uh, five mile. I was finna say five and below, but that's five miles away. Whatever that little app is, we'll put it on there too. Um, I prayed a nice little penny for it. There's nothing wrong with it. Um, the good thing about that particular dresser, and I'll turn it around so you guys can see it, is if you can see those um little lines right there the uh strip across there the little silver strip across those are actually drawers so there you go there's a closer look right if you can see that those are actually drawers and they're jewelry drawers so let me turn you back around <clears throat> Those are actually jewelry drawers and super cute. Love it. Love my dresser. I just want a mirror dresser. So it is what a TI is, baby. <laughs> so it is what a TI is. But I'm going to take my time. I ain't in a rush or whatever. You know, I don't care about nobody judging. Anywho, back to the curtains. I told you I'm a drifter. Um, so those are the white ones. I found some white ones for the dining area for the, um, patio window in there, but I did find these gorgeous, gorgeous boys here. <laughs> these bad mama jammers. Oh my God. Look at that, honey. So they're silver. Let me see. If we can get up into this, okay? Let's get up into this. So. It is a silver curtain. Or like a gray curtain with some silver detailing in it. I don't know if the silver detailing is picking up. But I do love the movement uh, in the design. So, yeah. Anywho, I did pick those up, and I mean, look at that. I don't think this camera is giving it any justice. Once they're hanging up, you guys will really get that. So, I'm thinking these <clears throat> up there. Yeah, you see that? Even putting it with the bed, you know? It's going to pop off like a white with it. Girl, that shit going to hit. It's going to hit anyway. I'll be so excited about the little things in life, don't I? 
am. So I also got a white one. I know it totally washes me out, right? Washes out. But I got a white one and it has, um, it's a bit of a little different. Um, they're by two different designers. Of course, this one's by BB and this one's by Waltham. The one for my bedroom is for Waltham. And then the ones for the dining room, I got our two panels as well with grumets on them instead of the slide through. And those are the grumets, in other words, right? It's a super cheap trick I have to keep these to where they keep that space in between them. Super cheap idea. I can show you guys once I hang them up. But got those. Um... It says they're in the, the color Nikita. Ooh, who is calling me, honey? Baby, she's not even that important. <clears throat> anyway, um, my honey in there. So, got those. And both of them came with two panels a piece. So, um, these are the pole top panels. But they are the 76 by 84 inch. And then the ones for the dining area are the 36 inch by 84 inch. Um, so yeah. And I'm thinking I'm going to leave it open with no sheer in the middle. Just for the summertime because I like my light, baby. She lean, I, I need my lights. I mean, y'all seen Crooklyn? That movie quickly. I need my lights. You know my condition. I need my lights. That's what he said in the movie. But anyway, if you ain't seen it, go watch it. Anyway, so that was a good find at Burlington. What else did I get at Burlington? Hmm. You know what? My tray. I got a tray. It's in there. I got a tray for my entryway table. So, yeah. Anyway, I was tired, Pooh. She tired. She in the bed. She is actually getting ready to go to bed. But I had came home to a package as well that I was super happy about. I need to, you know what? She ain't got time for this. Don't judge me. Oh, you know what? For some reason, soda now, I love my Pepsi. I only drink Pepsi. That is my thing, right? Um, but my soda or whatever be tasting a little bit different since she don't smoke cigarettes no more. I don't know what it is, but it seems like if we hit right there, right there is where it be hitting at, I swear. <clears throat> Excuse me. Anyway, so I kept, I seen this package. It was sitting on the entryway table or whatever when I got home, clearly because babe got it for me or whatever. And I was just like, I just knew that it was something for my puppy or something for my puppy is what I thought it was. Um, and then I was like, oh, yeah, I forgot I had ordered some soap. I should go get it so you guys can see it because I had two packages in today. So... Let me go get that, right? <laughs> Let's go get that. <laughs> Boo, yeah. So... I had two orders today. I surely did. Um, so, the first one was, I don't know if you guys know, but boop, yeah, boop, yeah. Dove has antibacterial soap. 
and I was searching and searching now how I stumbled upon this gym, okay? Uh, prepping for surgery and all of that, and I am not a dial kind of girl. Just not, right? And I know, like, hey, you can go get you some dial or whatever and really do the dang thing, right? And I just didn't want that. And I wasn't into, like, the organic soaps and, like, you know, whatever have you. I just wanted some Dove or something that I was used to, that my skin was already used to, and that I would get some moisture um, because it is recommended for unscented lotion. Excuse me. How rude was that? Just gonna burp like that anyway um one of the things is to have antibacterial so now i have my hero cleanse of course to use that it is a uh medical grade of antibacterial soap with some form of something in it that does something to your skin to prep you for surgery so outside of that i did not want to use dial I mean, it has a few, um, I would say flavors, but scents is what it is. It has a few scents and comes in a different, you know, whatever. But Dove did come out with this bad boy here, and I had to get it. So, started going in the stores looking for it. I went in Walmart. I went in Target. I went into a few places, and... No antibacterial dub. So I was under the assumption that everybody else had gotten to the party before me, right? Maybe I was just late to the party um, and they had bought it all out. So waited about a week, went back. Let's try this sh again. Honey, why is there no antibacterial dub here? What is going on and why? Okay, nevertheless, mm, you know what? What's wrong with you, boo? Is what I said to myself. And myself was like, what you mean? Or whatever. And I was like, bitch, go to Emmy's on. Girl, you know, you know Emmy's on. Got it going on. Don't even do that. Okay? Don't even do that. So, that's what I did. And I went on Emmy's on. And boom, she got her dove so Love that, right? So, bow. This is her. And I actually got, this is six bars. And I got two packages of four count. So, another eight, right? So... Boom, got enough to take with me to surgery and I'm gonna take probably four bars with me and then I'm also stocked up at home. So, Amazon came through for your girl once again. Yes, indeed. Um, So, second package, right? I know y'all waiting on it. The next package that I walked into, these were, it was a good day. It was just really a good day. Anyway, was, um, I ordered, I was looking, I had already gotten some new makeup because I hadn't bought any in a very long time. And so, really been checking this makeup brand out online, looking up the reviews and things like that. And I was talking to my sister about it. And it just so happens because, you know, my sister and I, we're just... She understands me from within, you know? So, we're kind of alike. And she's like, oh, sister, I got that already. You should try it. And I was like, really, do you like it? She's like, oh, yeah. And then she started going over the different products from the line that she had. Um, and so, yeah, I decided, let's do that. Uh. Yes.
Sorry, I had to get my thumbnail. Thank you. So it's the Il Maquillage. Um, the Il Maquillage New York. And this is the packaging. Now, I am a sucker for packaging, right? Um, I feel like most of what we pay for a lot of our products that we buy is due to the packaging. So, hey, call it what you will, right? So, decided to go ahead and get an order of that. Try it out. Um, it's super cool. Um, didn't take much time at all to get here to be shipped to me. So, and it's super cool, right? So, it's done. And this is not sponsored or anything like that. So, here we go. My OCD can feel a little better, right? <clears throat> I love this little get up. She's super affordable. So, like I was showing you guys, this is the box of the Il Maquillage New York. Um, it's a black box. It has the silver writing here. And it does just say Il Maquillage. If you guys can see that. Super cute, sleek. I love that. Um, and it just, it also has their handles and information on the outside of the box so as well right and this is how your package now I did open it because I was like too excited so it's an unboxing with you guys as well but it's just not live right so this is the inside of her right you get a message there and it tells you how it works um and what's super cool about this product is that you do get to try the products right um they're truly yours for 14 days which is a trial you can try out their makeup and which is started from the day they were delivered to you starting from the moment you get it um you get to give it a free trial run if you like it Go ahead and pay for the product. You get to keep it. If not, go ahead, return it. It's okay. Um, and they'll refund you <clears throat> your money or whatnot, right? So I'll just go ahead and read what the box says so you guys can kind of get it a little bit. It says how it works. Um, number one, try the products. These products are yours to try for 14 days starting on the day they were delivered. Love it or return it. If you love them, keep them. If you're shockingly don't like it, just visit uh, the website to get your uh, return label and instructions and things like that within 14 days of delivery um, and it will end at the end of your trial you'll just won't be charged for the products so super cute got any questions it gives you some info there um, and then it gives you this cute instruction card on how to actually use it and I don't know if that's going to, you know. So, and it just goes over how 75% of women get foundation wrong. Which is true, you know. Um, so, it just says to apply two pumps to your face or jaw or your entire face, jaw and neckline. Blend it out with a brush or a sponge, not with your hands. Um, and it gives you a couple of rules and things like that on how to do that, right? Um, it also gives you a receipt um, exact telling you what exactly you got. And I also got a mystery gift and a, another gift in my package as well. So we'll be looking at those. All right, and it comes super cute. Like the whole little setup is to die for, right? 
so you have this confetti and all of this in the box and it has all your products and things like that right so let's see here let's see here super cool these are the four items that we got super cute right <clears throat> got that gives you some nice information i just totally i'm here for the packaging it's the packaging for me so <clears throat> i got the fuck em flawless uh concealer which is that one I got that one. I got the Woke Up Like This Foundation. Boom. And two gifts. So, let's see what our two gifts are. I can't wait to actually try this makeup out. Um, definitely going to have to do a video for that. I totally want you guys to get and see what that is all about. Okay. So, I got an ink liner. So, an eyeliner. And I got a brush. A brush one. And, ooh. I like that. So that's the brush 100. That is the head on the brush. Let's see if you can see that. Boom. So it comes with a brush that has a little cover. And the brush just has the logo on it as well. Right? That's cute or whatever. I totally love the gifts. Um... And the way the foundation is packaged as well, I love the names and things like that. Like, it's a lot of things going on here that I actually like um, that even your high-end luxury makeup lines or brands won't give you, right? Um, but foundation... What's wrong? You just nosy. What you want? A can to get me a soda. You get your soda and you get your ass out. Hurry. Yeah. Oh, damn. He always want to get a soda or come in here and I don't want no bloopers. Anyway. It sounds like a whole rat over there. Come on, can you give me a soda? And all you hear is. Y'all see how he do me? This is super cute, though. Yo, Sorry. Excuse me? Yeah, you're trying hard. A little sleepy fat. Oh, just gonna. Hey, can you close the door? Oh. Just gonna disrespect me? Anywho. Don't. Don't mind. Don't mind him, okay? Okay. So, moving right along, I also got the um, foundation, and I love the way it's packaged. Super cute. Look at that. She is hidden. And I got the, um, it says, the most reviewed foundation online, okay? It has some info. This is the woke up like this. Now, you got to do what you got to do to get what you need, baby. I don't know if this is for you, but this is for me, okay? She's for me. I don't know if she's for you, but she was for me. So, go on on there online and check it out. Now, it also says, sorry, I don't speak low maintenance. Isn't that like... So cute. 
Now, I will say, um, packaging, it's a nice size bottle. How many ounces is this? She's probably your typical. Anyway. And say, how many ounces is this? Oh, okay, yeah, it's one ounce. So it's a 30 mil, a one ounce bottle. She gives me like, she really gives me a 90s vibe. Look at that. So yeah, that was my surprise that I got. I am so, babe's talking shit because I am so tired. And I tell them, I am about to turn it in. I swear, I'm tired. So that's my little goodies or whatever. And that's what I had got. Mm -hmm. Sure did. I sure did. Or whatever. I was happy about that. That made me happy. And. It brought peace to my soul. So. Nevertheless. She about to turn it in. Um, tomorrow is. What is tomorrow? Saturday. Tomorrow is Saturday. Why can't I remember the day of the week? I, that means I need to go to bed. It's 9, 16. I need to go to bed. Um, so nevertheless, tomorrow I am probably going to get up and do some things around the house. Um, I actually wanted to redo my living room. So that's the only thing on the agenda for tomorrow. And Kay, that is what is on the agenda. I got to show y'all my pajama set, though. Look at this. Or whatever. Let me turn y'all around. Ain't she cute? Like, ain't she cute? Look at that. Oh, look at this, though. Look, see, I be drifting, y'all. I be drifting. I don't care. Oh, well. I got these pillows. Um, I haven't took them apart yet, but I did get these uh, for some redecorating that I'm doing at TJ Maxx. And um, they I actually got them on sale. They're so nice for uh, $10. So that was a cool little steal. And they actually go well. They match the curtains or whatever. Look at these. That's nice. That makes my heart sing. So I'm gonna take those curtains down and that's gonna be what it is or whatever. So, see you when I see you, baby. Good morning, Houston. Okay, I'm not in Houston, but anyway, it's not even morning. But anyway, I digress. Hi, cousins. Don't, don't even try it, bitch. Don't even try it. Don't you dare. Don't judge me. Judge your mother. I keep telling y'all. I know you've seen that mess. I'm trying to get it together, y'all. I am trying. If, baby, this is my life. You know, like, she can't even... She trying, baby. She is trying. Okay, so I'm switching over my hangers. So, <sighs> my life is a mess right now. So, don't judge me. Nevertheless, she's getting it together. Anyway, so, getting some things done. You guys know I was doing some organizing and things like that in my room. Like I said, it's not even morning. It is... 1208 um whomever however 
we, you and I, are getting ready to go grab some things. Um, <clears throat> now, I got a prescription coming in the mail for my face. Y'all know I've been working on my face, okay? Um, and so, basically, I was told not to use the face washes that I've been using. Um, however... Sorry, y'all trying to get y'all together here. However, um, <laughs> I need to wash my face. So, that's what we're going to do. And we're going to use something that's not going to be too harsh or whatever. But, we still going to use it, right? Um, if I can find it. Like, where is my face wash? Alright, so yeah. We just gonna do this today, which is our renewing, um, renewing SA cleanser for normal skin. And that's the reason why I don't want to use that one, because it's not, I don't have normal skin. You know, I actually have. So let's do that. Let's get the face wash that I know I need to use. Um, I've been using another one and I actually like it or whatever, but I'm waiting on, of course. <sighs> Why well, I can't never find shit when I need it? Mind you, I used it the last two days. And I know I was putting it, I put it up because, um, the note from my doctor said to stop using it. And so yesterday I didn't use it, but now I can't find it or whatever. This is, this is just crazy. I, what's going on? Oh, found it. <laughs> I found it or whatever. So we are going to use our pan oxal because that is what I was using the last few days. So I don't want to switch it up until it's time to switch it up. You know what I mean? So. Set you guys right here. Anyway. So we are going to wash my face really fast. And I am going to dry it with a. I usually dry. Hold on. A dry wash cloth and I need to get more um white wash cloth because I wash my face in the morning but I don't wash it with this in the morning when I get up I wash it just regular hot water and a clean towel right but before I get out or anything like that, I have been using this in at night, using this. Um, especially since we came back from the jump, the trampoline park. I am telling you, when I went to the trampoline park, and that damn kid hit me in the face, okay? We were in the dodgeball area in the dodgeball field or whatever and he hit me on the face with a ball like right here and instantly because I know all the dirt and everything that was on the fucking ball just just it was like oh face her face boom and it was on it like a porch monkey I swear to god instantly break out right I was like oh fuck my life you know, just, uh. Something's on my tube. Mmm. There it goes. Got it. <laughs> but yeah. So we're gonna just rub this in. And when I came home, I used this immediately. See, I can still see and feel 
but it's not as bad as it was I will say that and I've been using um, moisturizer and that's all I've been putting on my face nothing more so I'm gonna let that sit on there for a couple minutes I was thinking about putting makeup on today but since I'm not really running out we're just gonna go run and grab a few things um, or see if we can grab those few things I think I'm gonna just go to Burlington there's a Ross I might stop at the Ross here by me let's see let's see if there's a Ross here um because if that's the case I can just you know stop at the Ross by me first <clears throat> and then from there head on over to the Burlington from whatever if I couldn't find in Ross any of the items on my list we can go on over to Burlington right uh, but yeah there is one right here by me so we'll stop there first and then we'll head on over to Burlington now I haven't become comfortable yet with um, vlogging in public but I do need to get used to that so I always take the camera with me I just never have the guts to take the camera inside and turn it on and things like that so I definitely need to get used to that or whatever but whatever um, let's check the fit for today I'm going to carry the same handbag that I had so we're just going to do this um, Los Angeles shirt it's just a blue it's just a blue tank or I'm sorry uh, oh my god I still have stuff on my finger no um, it's just a blue shirt um, cropped tied up with uh, some denim boom with my little slides that's what we doing and I'm gonna have the same purse that I had on probably yesterday so yeah and I need to get that off of here so let's do this so yeah that's what we doing finish wash this off and then I am just gonna put the same um, hydrating lotion that I was using the last couple of days for combination skin so boom and that's all I'm gonna put on my face um I'm only going to grab a few things I'm gonna stop at those two stores those two stores only so that's it and yeah we're coming right back so I don't want to put any makeup on or lashes it's a real natural kind of day a chill vibe kind of day right mm. and I know this is not a white towel but it was the first one I grabbed right I need to grab some white face cloths too because I have plenty but I need, you can never have too many washcloths right alright so um, now that that is done boom um, do I want baby hairs I've been enjoying not having to get up and do my hair. That's been lovely. Um, to say the least. That has been super duper awesome. But we are going to hook them up just a little bit along. I guess what? Mm. We can see. So we're going to use some shine jam. Nothing major. And hook up these baby hairs right quick. And we ain't even Fatty, what's wrong with you? Oh. 
because she was in there crying, girl. You know, I don't want nobody messing with my baby. Anyway. See, we didn't do nothing major. Just a little razzle-dazzle. Nothing too major. Sometimes, you know, my sideburns really get on my nerves because they just want to curl up, you know? And I freaking, it drives me up a wall sometimes. Not gonna lie. Everybody else loves it, and I be like, girl, not when you really trying to go for a certain look. <laughs> you don't want that. So, I decided I'm gonna go ahead and do the other side only because... You never know. You might flip this hair. And we we not finna do that. So let's just go all the way. Especially being that we're not wearing makeup, right? I took that braid out, don't judge me. Cause I'm not into having my edges braided I just I don't like that and so I'm glad she didn't but it was one that I had to take out okay so baby hairs is laid and boom so I'm trying to see they're not completely loose, so I don't really want to manipulate them too much. I've just kind of been, I think we're just going to do the whole, let's just, peeny bit, <laughs> peeny bit, peeny bit, mm. peeny bit, okay. I know I should have a black, actually, I have a white. Penny B. Penny B. I'm gonna put this white scrunchie over it because it goes with my shirt. Oh. Then again, let me fix my pony. Oh, Jesus. You know what? Let's just do this. All right, if it's going to act right, girl, because, you know, you don't be want to act right. Some of the braids be jealous that they get to go, other braids get to go to the party, and they don't. One hey, every party ain't for everybody. So, yeah. Gonna take this and put it in a fine pair. Okay. All right, and then we just going, she going to fall out, and I don't want her to fall out, baby, so we got to double her, all right, boom, just like that, Ow. and now that my face is dry, I really wanted my face to dry as well, I'm going to go ahead and put some of this lotion on my face mm -hmm. does it have SPF in it? I don't think it does but my prescription that is on the way does so boom 
gonna be using that and that only for the next six weeks just to see how that works now about to get dressed put these away um throw on some clothes here and i'll see you when i see you Anywho, so that's what she's giving. And I just want to let some light in here. That's why I can't wait to change my curtains back over because the light that comes in here is amazing, balls. So let's go ahead and hit on out. All right, this lighting is horrible. I need to figure that out <clears throat> on this camera. But anyway. You like my little shades or whatever? They give off that blue. That's the only reason why I wore them today, really, and just in case I need them while on the road or whatever. So, we are in the car. Mm -mm, sorry, y'all. And we are getting ready to go to the Ross. Something just tells me I should just go to, if I don't stop at the Ross, what's really going to be in Ross, you know? Anyway, I need to stop and get fucking gas. That's what I need to do. Hmm. I can't wait to have me a Tesla and have me a new coil. Anywho, so I'm thinking that's what we're going to do is stop and get gas first. And then go to the Ross. Well, the Ross, I don't need gas for, but I need Ross for Burlington. I mean, gas for Burlington. So, I guess we'll go put gas in. Hmm. That's what we're going to have to do if we want to go anywhere. So, I'm thinking that's what we're going to do. I need a, um, Butch Madugi, I need to go to five below. Ross is right there. Hmm. Anyway. Well, let's hit the road, Jack. Getting richer, that ass getting thick on my diamonds. They keep getting wetter. Fuck, I look like going back and forth with a little bitch that is not on my level. Fuck, I look like going back and forth with a little bitch that is not on my level. Woo, woo, woo. Hi again. Again, hi. Hi, cousins. My cousins. What y'all doing, cousins? Organizing today and some cleaning today or whatever. She's still working on the closet, but she getting stuff together nevertheless. Excuse the lighting. I have my blue lights on in here. So, um, let me stop this. So, I have definitely been doing some things in here I did change um, the curtains like I wanted to do there um, but we got some technical difficulties going on over there we're definitely gonna get into that but nevertheless it's done I got the mirrors up on that side and on this side so boom that's babe's fan he needs that that's our fan we need that um so yeah and just been doing some things around here or whatnot so i did do put those up today that turned out great we got this one in here today which is shopped from my home from the hallway so anyways i I'm getting ready. Yes, she was cute today or whatever. We got something going on over here. It's not going to stay like this. But for now, I still use this chair to do what I need to. Um, and then, yeah. So, oh yeah. We got a new baby here. I love her. I just love her. Anyway. So, that is the tea. I E 
Look at the difference on these yellow lights and my white light in there. Anyway, I am actually getting ready to take a shower because your girl needs to wash her ass. Um, what time is it? Nine. It is 9.49. So, she definitely needs to wash her ass. Okay? Um, and then, I'm going to take a shower and I'll possibly come back because I want to shower so I can go ahead, get a comb together. Don't judge me. Judge your mother. And I want to watch Cruella, the movie Cruella. It came out today, I believe. And I'm going to watch it on Disney+. Plus. I asked the kids if they wanted to watch it. They said no. So, I'm excited nevertheless. About to do that. So, um... I'll probably do some clips or something like that on Snapchat. Yeah, so about to go ahead and get into the shower. Mm -hmm.